Hello guys, welcome back to another episode of Cut Reviews and this is the Filmora Tutorials. So as mentioned in the earlier episode, I have created the playlist for the basic Filmora Tutorials and if you guys are watching this video for the first time or if you guys want to learn more about Filmora editing software, this is the playlist for you. And this will cover all the basic aspects of a video editor. So this is the second episode and in this I will cover how you can add various effects and transition using Filmora 13. So once you go to the Filmora homepage, you can create a new project from here. And once the project is here, I'll upload all three clips from here. So once you upload those three, you can just drag and drop it here. And just to show you the example, uh, I'll just make it bigger. Okay. So I have all three of these videos here. So for adding effects and transition, you don't have to do nothing. It's everything is there in uh, Filmora. So if you if you go here, if you see the top and uh, menu, if you see the top menu, you can see the transitions right here and beside it, there's effect. So both of them you can apply at the same time. So for the transition where the clips are adding, you just have to put the transition there. So whatever transition you want, you, you want the zoom, you want the light, you want all type of different effects, everything is here. Uh, there are certain uh, options which says trending, fade and dissolve, zoom, slide, whatever you want, you can add it from here. So I'll just go in the trending and uh, I'll just add this grab warp zoom here. So in the middle, you can just bring it here. So the middle part where the clips are joining, you can add it there. And then you can, uh, from here, you can increase the or decrease the length of the effect. So just keep it bare minimum so that there's, so the people will understand that there is a transition and it goes right in. So if you want to do a zoom transition, it will take you from one clip to other clip like this right here so you can adjust the time from here the more you put the more zoom will be here so i just like the quick transition so i put it little so that's it and then the the more you break the clips the more you can add the effects from here you can check how it is going so you, once you click on this it will give you how it will look like so i'll add this fade and dissolve here so i'll just do it very little so these are the various transitions you can add on the clip and now let's go to the effects so go to the effects section and from here you can do the light leak you can do the vibrations in this so the clip will be shaking you can do base basic you can do the shake as well so this will give same effect like a TikTok or Instagram videos which are sync with the beat. So I'll just put one throw in effect right here in this clip. And then I'll do that light leak in one of this clip. So you just drag and drop on the clips and that's it. And then the last one I can put the slow zoom effect. So now I added all the three effects and all the three transition. This is my final video. So all the three clips have different effects. Uh, the first one has the light leak. The second one is zooming. And then uh, the third one is shaking and it is zooming at the same time. So with the help of these transitions and effect, you can make multiple clips which look exactly the same in one, in one frame. So this is the magic of effects and transition. So guys, this was it. This was how you can create various effects and transition with the help of Filmora 13. I'm sure you guys are finding this course very easy and if you guys want to know more about Filmora 13, you can always uh, download the software and you can visit their creator hub to know more. And also, if your family and friends want to be a video creator, this software you can share or this tutorial you can share to them and they can know the basics of Filmora. If you guys are watching this for the first time, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell notification icon so that if I post any tutorial, you are notified. But this was it from my side. I'll see you again on another episode of this playlist. Until then, just take care and have a good one and also happy editing. Goodbye.